At the Wear 2.0 conference this year, Google announced that they would be doing a mashup with Google News and Google Earth. The new Google News layer lives under the Gallery tab and sits with other news organizations like the New York Times and National Geographic magazine. With the New York Times layer, as well as the over 4,500 organizations sourced through the Google News layer, news and location truly have become merged. If at the same time you turn on the Wikipedia layer and the Panoramio layer, you have background material, as well as images. The final layers that we're activating are Google Earth Community. You can see how many people contribute. And also the National Geographic magazine. The most recent story they've done is San Franciscans and their dogs. The final layer here that really adds a different dimension are the Rumsey historical maps. And if you click on up comes the window and the option to overlay the past onto the present. We showed this layer in a previous screencast, but it still blows my mind. Here are YouTube videos geotagged. The next layers I'm going to activate are the U.S. government layers. There are city boundaries, postal code boundaries, congressional districts, I'm going to go ahead and deselect the news and information layers we turned on earlier. Clearing the map allows us to focus on different information. When we start to talk about boundaries like city boundaries, postal code boundaries, U.S. congressional districts, we start to talk about a different scale and it behooves us perhaps to zoom out just a little bit. Just being able to change the view, to pull out, to get the bigger picture, is a lesson in and of itself. I know my city boundaries. I certainly don't know congressional district boundaries. It's very valuable to be able to seamlessly move amongst different types of media. There's written via the New York Times, Google News, and Wikipedia. The visual. Panoramia and YouTube and at the same time you have that which is vetted New York Times news sources and that which is community created content Panoramia, Wikipedia. There's also scale from Street View to Congressional District level. And finally time with the Rumsey historical maps you can go from the past to the present and back again. This is a multimedia, multimodal approach that just seems to have unlimited potential for news organizations.